Check out that tower. Bet you could get the lay of the land from up top. Maybe. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for a sock. Perfect. Not that I'm too worried about him, though. You should be. We won't have the advantage of surprise again. I don't think he was expecting much from you. Wait, was that a compliment? That, that sounded like a compliment. His guys are idiots, but a sword is... We just need to stay the hell away from him. Give me a second. I can wait. <laughs> Don't recognize this. It's not one of the three symbols. Still, could be a chance to make some extra cash. All right, let's see what you do. Oh, fountains. What's that song? <coughs> not sure. Huh? Don't think so. Hmm. Shut off. Reset the fountains. Guess this is a thing. Yeah. That's another. Here for your amusement. You've got two more to go. Ah, back to where I started now. There it is. Interesting. Some kind of Poisala token. It's not one of our three symbols. Might be worth trading once we get back home. the appeal of people like Asav. Easy. He finds men who are weak and offers them power. Gives them purpose. Purpose? Sounds more like bullshit to me. Where are you going? Want to climb it with me? I really want to, but uh, someone should keep watch for Asav's forces. Good call. Hey, up and away. So far, so good. Mm. Be careful. 
Nearly there. <clears throat> Here's our three symbols. Well, that took less time than I expected. Huh. Wonder what that could be. For future reference. Shiva's axe. And behind door number two. Aimed right at those Hoysala ruins. It's an old fortress. Tucked into the mountainside. I'll just mark that on the map. With an axe. Let's see what's behind the trident port. Another old fortress. Just beyond those waterfalls. Trident mark on the map for you. Last but not least, the Bodor. And another old fortress. Sitting smack dab in the middle of the lake bed. I'll jot a bow on the map in that spot. Each one was pointing towards a different fortress. Those will be the best places to look. Perfect. How'd you get tangled up with the Sav anyway? Purpose? Rather not go into it. You certainly seem to have a thing for you. Don't remind me. Proved useful at the time, but... Yeah. Uh, do tell. Rather not. Maybe over drinks? Not enough alcohol in the world. Fraser, hold up. Fraser, well, we've got nothing. company up ahead. I say we do the wall. What? Man down over here. Right, in the clear. Let's have a look around. Someone went to a lot of trouble to hide this. I hope that was productive. Found another token. Has it got anything to do with the tusk? <laughs> Don't think so. Well, no harm, so long as we hit all the forts you marked in the tower. the military expert. What's Asav's strategy here? He spread out his men, hoping to stop us in our tracks. Not what I would do. So what would you do if you were Asav? Besides lose the beard? Hang back? Let you do the heavy lifting, then swoop in and grab up the task once you've done all the hard work. Devious. Oh, hold up. 
Look there. One of Asov's trucks. Looks clear out here. Interesting circular motif. Like the disc. We're definitely in the right place. Look up there. Parashurama's bow. Matches the symbol in the tower. So, Parashurama. 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 Right. Who was he again? Okay. Six avatar of the god Vishnu. A fearsome warrior. This should do the trick. Okay. Going. Going. Oh. Let's get inside. What do you suppose this place was? Hard to say. A fortress? Not the right layout for a temple. Shithole, finally. I was starting to think the boss was all talk. It's Caesar! You boys really Why? don't want me shooting I from down here. Ah. That's it. We're clear. Probably alluded to the others. Can't be helped. Come on. Okay. We're all clear. It won't be the last of them. There was a big truck parked out front. We'll keep our eyes open. <sighs> Would have preferred a head start over a song. Not much we can do. Besides, doesn't matter who starts, only who finishes. Fair point. What is it? A shrine? Don't think so. Don't see any deities hanging about. Let's find a way up. Uh, follow me! Safety's off. All right, everyone spread out. Hmm? Watch it, another one down. We know you are down. out there. Shit, I'm 
Another one down. Shit. All right, we're clear. See? I can't be quiet when need be. Let's press on. Just what I was going to say. No, I'm stepping that gate. Perfect. That should do it. Across at least. Damn it. See another way over here? <laughs> Sit tight. Or stand. Stand tight. Copy that. Beg your pardon? You all right? I'm fine. Okay, guess this isn't the way in. Oh, there you are, having fun. Impressive. Thanks. Come on. Well, looky here. What are you willing to bet? Told you it's some kind of key. Gold star for you. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient horse law jigsaw puzzle? Ah, of course. I'm making a bow. Sharama. Now what? Now I guess we turn this crank and see what happens next. You think it's safe? You know that treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Neither is being a mercenary. Difference is when I pull the pin on a grenade, I know what's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. <laughs> Feel that? Teresa, mm -hmm. mm. right. look at that. Holy hell. There's a massive relief carved into the side of that mountain. And you were worried that we were going to turn that crank and die. Guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learned a lot. Hoysalar Empire was kind of his thing. Took up a lot of his time, though. Me, if I go. Digging for treasure, I better make a buck or two. Oh, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business? Hmm. Made a real mess of it. What, you should know? Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well, it's a conversation for another time. So, where to next? There's the fort above the waterfalls with the trident. And there's the fort in the mountains sporting the axe. I suppose I should have asked about the Drakes before I took the job. Not much to tell. I know Nate pretty well, Sam less so. He seemed to just 
appear out of thin air. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. This is open now. So, waterfalls and mud. Check. Hey. Just so you know, Nathan Drake is no longer in the picture. You don't have to worry about it. I had my concerns. Why do you accept my offer? I'm not one to look a gift horse in the mouth. Especially with everyone wanting to see me fall. I hear that. But on the plus side, huh? I'll be right back. Wait, what? Ah. Another one. <gasps> Another token for my collection. Want anything? Found another token. All right. And we were talking about... Oh, right. There's a plus side to people wanting to see you fail. Oh, there's a plus side? Oh, when people have low expectations, it's much easier to take them by surprise. As far as I'm concerned, this business is tough enough on your own. You have to take any advantage you can. You always worked alone? Mostly. How old were you when you started? Young. Learned? Ah, uh, be right back. Where are you going? Duly noted. simple. What have we got here? I've got your brothers and sisters waiting for you.
Pick it back up? Yeah. So, anyways, learned quickly enough I needed to let people think they were getting their way, and then I could get the upper hand. Too subtle for me. I always prefer the direct approach. Yeah, whatever works, I say. Crawling with rebels. All finished. The turret is set up. I think so. Spoke too soon. Heads up! <coughs> Shit! Notice anything about this statue? It's holding a trident. One of our three symbols. Yes, and it's pointing at those ruins. Right. Well done. Glad I'm good for something. Looks like there might be a road leading up there. Another Hoysala token for my collection. After all that, you find anything? Got another token for our collection. Check it out. It's Ganesh's trident. Spotted this on the tower, too. Ganesh. Remover of obstacles. That's very good. Oh, well. Figured if we were looking for a star scout, and read up on him. Okay, well, he's a good one to know. You pray to him when you start something new, or need to clear your mind of doubts and worry. Ah. Remover of obstacles. Is the gate secured? Not yet. I've got your Waiting on Cobra 8. Let's just keep this quiet as long as we can.
one day, we will restore this place. Yes, the air here is clean. This is what it's all about. Soon we will rule like our forefathers did. And my family, my so-called friends back in my village, they all mocked me for joining up. Forget about them. That's in the past. Hey, living on scrap. I will show them the way to live like a king. That's the spirit. This will make a hell of a racket. Okay. Here goes nothing. Get away now! Okay. Nice shot! I think that's a lot of them. You alright? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more positive outlook, sort of. What's this? That's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. <laughs> How about you? That's two. Here's another one. Three down. Found you. Only one left. Last but not least. Do it? Okay. Back to the big... Hey. You did it. Got down right out. Did. Oh, come on. Looks like we're going under. Radio. This one needs to look like a trident. Good guess. Oh, this 
one's a bit trickier. It's Ganesh. Hello, sir. Right. Let's turn the water on. Whoa, well, whoa. Well, what's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. It's two out of three now. Also, I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's pretty funny. Last stop, the fort embedded in that mountain. That'll be the one with the axe. At least your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought MREs. You're no fun. Reza, we've come in reinforcements. Figures. Hello. Brothers, where are you? Do a sweep. Oh. Someone took him out. We have company. Oh. What's your time? Another guy down here. Keep looking. They are here somewhere. by the mountain left. Indeed. Makes more sense why it solves after the tusk now. Figured he just wanted the money, like us. He'll use it to rally people to his cause, wavered in the government's face. Just like all the other times. This has happened before? Oh, yeah. Ever since the young... One sec.
marking you down. Isn't a bad view anywhere around here. Can't hide from me. Hop in my pocket, little token. This fight has happened ever since the young king lost to the Persians. Everyone's wanted to lay claim to it, to this land. And here I thought we were just going on a treasure hunt. We are. Let men like Asav fight over it. It's none of our concern. Fighting wars was my concern for a time. Good point. Hold that thought. You trying to give away our position? Yes. waited hundreds of years for me to find you. Okay, what were we talking about again? Huh. Oh yeah, <clears throat> right. So you may have fought wars too, but you did it for the cash. Usually. What about when you worked for Saab? <laughs> Definitely a cash grab. Hardly worth the trouble. Ouch. Why do it then? Needed to establish my rep, eh? Figured I'd start with the worst of the bunch. Nowhere to go but up. Wait. Over there, in that cliff wall. See that archway? Looks intact. You coming with? Feel like stretching my legs. <laughs> right, Eo. <laughs> What is this place? You got me. <laughs> well, will you look at that? Monkeys. You seem excited. I like monkeys. Looks like there's something in the structure there. Yeah, monkeys. Besides monkeys. <laughs> what have we here? See. Is it just me, or does that look like a map? Looks like our map. Huh. I'll just jot that down. Hey, fancy a ride in my pocket? What about the symbols up there? Symbols? Those figures must be the old Hoysala kings. Eleven, all in all. Hey, no hitchhikers. Shoo! Oh, you're no fun. What, you want them shitting all over the seat? Look safe. Smells safe. 
Let's go. Beautiful out here. Is this your first visit to India? Yeah. Wait a sec. Watch out. The rebels might be here already. Hey, look. Shiva's axe. Man. Glad I climbed that tower, eh? Shiva. He was the god of destruction, right? Yes, but maybe not in the way you're thinking. Not literal destruction, then? That, but also in a more positive sense, like losing the ego, ditching bad habits. Shedding old attachments. Exactly. Once more, with gusto. Go. Hey, I'll take care of this one. Okay. Salah versus the tiger. Doesn't seem like a fair part. Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. They've left their climbing gear. They should come in handy. Not there. Correction. Our climbing gear. Oh. God, a bit hard on the wrists. Okay? Slightly deep, but I'm good. Good. Let's keep moving. Oh my. What the hell is this? Okay, let's see what this does. That statue moved. Well, I'll be going to hell. That's elaborate. Oh shit, statue moved again.
I think that did it. Come on over. Coming. Oh, for goodness sake. Three statues with two different symbols now. The star and the rings. They're all boys than our sun symbols, but I like your descriptions better. Make an axe. Oh, what the hell? That's not fair. Shiva. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. Mm. Oh, shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. <sighs> Here we go. There'd be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? Mm. My partner tends my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with a bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. I was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. What the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want a salve to get ahead of us. You know, I've had my fair share of screw-ups. <laughs> you just pick yourself up and move on. I don't like to fail. No one does, love. Let's head back to the car. <laughs> Gotta love a shortcut. Glad we don't have to go back the way we came. <laughs> I would have made you dodge the axes. If you 
want to look anywhere else out there, now's the time to do it. Right. Look, for what it's worth, it's your kick-ass reputation that got you this job. Plus, I figured you could use the money. You're not wrong. Honestly, though, it's actually nice working with a woman for a change. <laughs> Do rot. Hey, what? hey, I'll be right back. Fraser? <laughs> Hello again. Really building up my calluses this trip. Hmm. Good thing I packed my thinking cap. Similar to that lock mechanism I saw earlier, but a bit more involved. I'm taking you with me. <laughs> 